Hello, this is Carrie with Idea Girl Media. Today I'd like to give you a more intimate view of Facebook's new timeline. Uh, this is it. This is how your profile will look once it's been converted into the new timeline. Um, really cool, this groovy banner that gives you a ton of space to feature the things that you like or who you are. Um, you will have your avatar that will follow you all over Facebook, wherever you interact. And then you get this summary of the things that were towards the top of your profile before. Uh, where you work, where you went to school, where you live, your your relationship status. And then these boxes, um, if you click them, will take you to um, a list of your friends, your photo albums, places you visited, and your page likes. Um, as you scroll down, you see that you get your status bar. Um, your update bar just as you did before and you can post something like creating Facebook videos or whatever you're up to just as before. When you're done you press post, no changes there. Um, it even gives you a place where um, other activity is noted, the music you're listening to while you're on Facebook under the new timeline, a summary of some recent activity, and then you have like two columns that sum up what you're doing. Um, I'd like to show you the timeline over here. That's it, It's the story of your life, and it goes through where you were born. Most people were not um, on Facebook when they were born, but they, you can put that information in, so it's kind of like your life scrapbook online. Um, when you graduated from high school, when you um, graduated from college and had kids, if you press um, on the decades, it'll take you to that point in your life. And for me, 2009 was a nifty year. And I uh, met um, Mark Hayes, a gospel and Christian music composer, with some business partners that year. I also met John Gordon, inspirational speaker and author. And then during 2009, I, um, with business partners, incorporated two companies, Romantic Endeavors and Life Impact Productions. And those um, are noted on my timeline. And those major life events, you can um, tag and they will appear larger in your timeline. And you would do that by going up here to your status bar and um, tagging it appropriately. As times, time goes by, um, those years are more and more summarized and they become like infographics, if you will. So um, just remember that um, you can always go back and edit or make things public or private as you like. This is how you change your cover image. Um, and you have, and I will tell you the secret, you have um, 500 or 855 um, pixels across and 320 pixels high to create whatever you'd like to do. So if you want to be your person, the person behind your business, or whatever, you can do that. Um, and here, if you um, want to keep this image as a certain specific image, you want to make sure you tag yourself um, so that that will come up here. Or you can leave that open and let it float from image to image as you build your timeline. So my name is Carrie and I'm with Idea Girl Media. Um, please friend up, subscribe, or join me on my fan page. I answer questions about Facebook for free there. And um, I look forward to seeing you on Facebook. Take care.